Hi, it's Rob Shapiro from Technique Peak. Now we're going to look at how to test the radial nerve. And the key to this one is to have the patient diagonally on the table. So you're going to come over to me, Frank. Just have your shoulder just off so I can get on here. Keep going. And I want to be able to depress it, so I'm going to use my hip to depress it. Okay. And come in through there. Make sure his head's in midline. Start in that position. Any symptoms at all? And the key with this one is we're going to how, how we're going to get our fingers. We're going to have to be able to get our finger in that direction. So as we do it, what we're going to have him do is we're going to depress it. Okay, we can do elbow extension, we can do pronation of the internal rotation of the whole arm, thumb goes in, go like that. on a deviation, and then as we go up, we start to go up until we, start to, we get symptoms of it. And we look at throughout the range, any pain or anything with that, Frank, you're good, and then come back. All right, so the key to this one is shoulder depression, internal rotation of the shoulder, elbow extension, finger flexion wrist only deviation, and come back out. Okay, and again, with all neural tension tests, the key is to come off slowly, and then to be able to get some type of range of motion. So I look specifically with this one, how much abduction do we get, and when does, when does Frank have that pain? All right, so radial nerve, Rob Shapiro from Technique Peak.